Hey Scrappin' Divas, it's Anna. So happy to see you guys. Well, not really see you, but you know. <laughs> Make this video. I haven't done one in a while. I know I'm so fired, right? Well, I made another wall hanging and um, I did a swap with Burley Kim, B E R L Y Kim on YouTube. She came to me and asked me to do a swap. How awesome is that? I was so excited. My first time ever that somebody on YouTube who doesn't know me wanted to do a swap with me. I feel so honored. I was so excited. <laughs> so, um, this is what I made for her. She said we could do it under Kim. Hi, Kim! Okay, so I made, I used the Baroque die because she had commented on the previous Baroque one that I did. So, um, I did one for her. And this is the first, um, let me open that up, there we go. Paper flowers, gotta make them look fluffy. Okay, so <clears throat> there's like a little um, a spray, that's from Michaels. And I just cut a piece of it off, and we all know the little bird he came from. That's a wild orchid craft, cherry blossom. That flower is from Gentile. And that's a vintage button. I just cut the shank off the back. And this right here, this right here is a clothespin. And I altered it and painted it. And I added, this is a fragment, and I added a vintage photo underneath. And then I adhered it to the um, clothespin. So, just added that on there. If she wanted to stick something underneath it, you know, she could. Okay. I'm trying to do this with Uno Mono. It's not working. There we go. So, um, she could do that. Or she could just leave it there. I just want it. Because she said that she does, like, vintage shabby chic. So, that's what I did. Everybody loves shabby chic, right? There's just no way you cannot like shabby chic. So, um, and the paper line that I use is, hmm, oh, it's the K & Company, Oh, where is the name brand of it? Oh, I'm looking at it at the math stack, it's that fauna paper one. <laughs> if that makes any sense to you guys, you guys know, by Brenda Walton, I guess it, it is, but, um, that's this paper line that I used, and what I did is I used um, acrylic, pink acrylic paint all the way around, and let me see, my focus isn't, I don't want it to be blurry, okay. So I painted all the way around with a pink paint, and then I took my vintage photo and just did the edges on the sides like that, all the way around, and I did that with all three of them. Okay. Oh, and for you, don't think that this is bad nails, honey. This is that shattered nail polish. Isn't it super fab? Love it. So, yeah, it's not me just coming on here with bad nails, okay? That's on purpose. <laughs> Anyways, moving on. Okay, and this one right here, of course, we know this is the Tim Holtz, um, his, uh, the dress form. So, I made her so pretty. I put some um, some lace here, and this is the kind that I believe came from <sighs> Joann's. I have so much lace up there. Like I'm, I'm actually starting to forget where stuff comes from because I'm a hoarder. Yes, I have an addiction. So, and then this is just some seam binding. This right here I do know is from Ooh La La Vintage Treasures. I bought some of the little um, cabbage flowers that. Um, Doreen and Patty have on their store. And I put some bling. I used the spool part and wrapped some really pretty lace around it. That stick pin, um, that was from Joe from Paper Drama. I had ordered some flowers and she um, had stick pins in there, so I used it. It was very hard for me to use it because it's my last one. So I have no more, Joe. I'm so sad. Okay, and then this one right here, that's the Michael's Butterfly. I put some bling in the middle, and the little trail is the Liquid Pearls. These right here are halfback pearls. And um, I honestly don't know where I got this flower from. 
I cannot claim <laughs> where it came from. And then I just wrapped some lace all the way around. So it's all the way around the flower. And these are the cherry blossoms from Wild Orchid Crafts. I tied everything with fiber. Um, and uh, for all through here, I did that. So, so it goes like that. And then the back. You know, on my last one, I totally didn't do the backing because I'm like, who's going to see that? But because I'm doing it in a swap, I didn't want to do it that way. So right here, I did the crackle, um, the crackle paint. Then right here, I put, um, I got this awesome from Ulala La Vintage Treasures. Um, Patty sells these, um, their craft paper and their um, um, an assortment of different envelopes. And I, and I only have one little envelope die. And um, so she has these, and it's only four bucks, and you get a bunch of different ones that are embossed or plain, and it comes with tags. It's really, really a great deal. So um, then this right here is the button that goes with the Tim Holtz, and I just put some seam binding in it. And then right here, I just wrote like a little note to Cam, and then, you know, my blog info. And so I just kept that there, and then I did the back here. It's just... I did the crackle, so it's a very light pink underneath, and then I did the white on top. So, that's that. But, this is the actual wall hanging. Hope you guys love it. I had a blast, and I wanted to make something really special for her, because this is my first swap, and I'm really excited. This not something, you know, like I said, nobody's ever asked me to do anything on YouTube before since I'm a rookie and I know nobody wants to take their chances on a rookie. I'm just a rookie on YouTube, ladies. I'm not a rookie in the altering <laughs> or scrapbooking. So, um, this is what I made. And I am still working. I know I told you like two videos ago that I'm working on a box and a mini. Yeah, I still am. <laughs> And um, those ones are going to take some time just for the fact that it's also for a special friend of mine who lives in the NYC, baby. And we're doing a swap, so I'm paying extra attention and doing everything carefully, so I'm not rushing it. But it is coming. It's in the works. I'm halfway done with both. So, anyways, all right, I'm not going to babble you guys, and you guys are going to fast forward to me. I know it. <laughs> okay, so I'll talk to you ladies later. Mucho hugs, everybody. Bye.